something. This Jesus that you call your Lord cannot be bewitched. Hallelujah. Can, he be, can anybody bewitch Jesus Christ? No. Hallelujah. And the Bible says he's sitting where? The Bible says he's sitting where? He's sitting at the what? Above what? Above what? He's sitting above all power principles, principalities and what? And all authorities. Hallelujah. He is the name that is above every name. Hallelujah. The Bible says, at the name of Jesus Christ, every knee shall bow in heaven, on earth, and under the earth. So the witches that people are so afraid of are taking roots from the tree that the Lord Jesus Christ, who is sitting in heaven at the right hand of the Father in majesty, he created the tree and they go under the earth, his earth, his ground, to take the roots of his tree to bewitch you. Now the question is, can you be bewitched? Why? Let me tell you why. Because you are hidden in Christ. You are sitting in Christ. To get to you, the enemy, the witches, will have to go through Jesus first. And where Jesus is sitting as king, the Bible in Revelation tells us, it tells us that there are angels and angels and angels, hallelujah, around him. So before you, anything can get to you, it must get through the number of angels, the multitudes of angels to get to Jesus. And if it can get to Jesus, if it can go through the angels, it must still then deal with the glory. It must still deal with the eyes that are just shooting out fire. Hallelujah. With glory that blinds, they must, it must still deal with that. And now, if it has the audacity and somehow manages to go through that, it must still go inside him and find you.